here on the OVC Digital Network by the senior setter, Mallory Mangan. And what a senior day and how appropriate for a senior to finish it off with a kill like that. Oh, it was great. It felt good to have all the seniors on the court too when we finished, so it was a happy ending. This was a really good year at home and obviously a lot of volleyball yet to be played with Murray State and Austin P waiting on the road. But uh, how nice has it been to play in front of the kind of crowds you've played in in front of this year? It's been a fun home season, I imagine. Oh, yeah, it's been great. We have, you know, we've had full stands for majority of the games this season. In, and I think that's one of the first times we've ever had this many people come out and support us. So I'm really excited for like, you know, the next years to come for everybody else. Reflect on your senior season, if you would, for a second. And as I said, there's plenty of volleyball to be played, but this is a team now with 19 wins. You've got 12 wins in the OVC. Did I say that I missed 12 wins in the OVC, seven home wins. I mean, this has already been a heck of a season. Oh, yeah. Um, I just think it's a great way for you, like, you know, the Cougars to come out and actually end on a winning season as a senior like it, it's been my first actual like we've had an unreal record in conference and everything included so I just think it's a great way to go out can you believe that it's almost over oh, for it's you it's so scary so thanks to my teammates for all that and I imagine it's gone pretty quick now as you think back yeah it's unreal like people say four years and it's, it's gone that fast well Mallory congrats on a great career and a great season and we look forward to uh, still some more to come thank you thank you that's the Cougar setter Mallory Mangan with us here and the Cougar head coach will uh, hopefully be joining us in a second. You want to go snag her for us? Yeah, she can. She'll deal with your headsets. Okay. Now comes the Cougar head coach. You got to put those on after her now. Yuck. <laughs> Cougars head coach Leah Johnson with us now, and coach, you continue the role here as you defeat Southeast Missouri State, and um, you know, last night it was the first set that maybe was a little shaky. Today, yeah. the second set against mm -hmm. UT Martin, but as you said last night, you forge on, you push through it, yeah. and, and they did that today. Yeah, you know, I think the our culprit tonight was, you always fear in a senior night that you're going to be high energy and then you're going to just sure. bottom out, sure. and, and, and it showed. You know, I'd like to think we're more mature than, than dealing with that, but I don't know that anyone doesn't fall victim to that in such an emotional time and with such an exceptional class of seniors like it was uh, there were tears of, you know before after during the game and, and they are a really special group and and that emotion is well deserved and well earned by them so you know I, I'm glad to see us respond and finish the game really strong and with all four seniors on the court to finish match point and a kill by the senior to finish it off yeah so very appropriate. There. good so and and while I know that you and the coaches will pick through things and, and, and work that out. End result is you get another win. And at this yes. point in the year, that's the key at this point. Yeah, we um, we knew we secured a top three seed in the tournament. And now, um, obviously, we want to keep competing to divide for a regular season championship. Uh, we have to go do that on the road. It's very challenging against two very, very good teams. Um, but bottom line, like we still have a week to get better before the tournament comes. And that's the number one focus. It's not who we play, it's how we play. It's who we are, how we execute our system, how we execute our plan, how we develop within five days and maximize our strengths. I know today it was about the seniors, but as I look, Jackie Scott for the second day in a yeah. row has uh, ties her career high now, now with kills, so she has been a big part of this, but as you look up and down this lineup, mm -hmm. there's a lot of contributions coming from a lot of different yeah. spots. And, and that's been the, the critical thing to our success. If we rely on one person, teams at this level make adjustments, yep. you know, um, and so for us to spread the wealth, as we call it, we talk about balance is beautiful, yep. and when we do that, we really have good success. Um, we're very hard to stop because we have threats in all positions. I thought in set four, our defense was outstanding, you know, and then we converted on that ball in transition, so and that's where our middles really shine. I thought they worked hard in transition and were able to get fed the ball in sets three and four really well. You talked to me last night about the mental toughness and the mm -hmm. strength of this team, and now you're going to need it because you go on the road yep. to face Austin P and Murray State, the two closest competitors. Yeah. Obviously, Murray State right in front. Austin P in pursuit. Yeah, um, absolutely. And they're going to have to be strong this weekend, aren't they? And I couldn't be more excited about that. Yeah. You know, it's. I think we are a group that's thriving for challenges. Um, we thrive for the next measure to meet and um, pass or fail. It doesn't matter. Like, our mindset is about growth, and so you don't grow unless you get out of your box. And I think going on the road, seeing, um, you know, two opponents that are at the top of the league with 
with us, it's that's what you want to be. Oh, you want to be in that situation. You want to be talking about that. You want to be craving that. So we're hungry for it, and I think it's just going to be a great match. Um, a lot of excitement. Uh, obviously, a lot at stake, but a lot to be gained, that's more right. importantly. So it, it's been a fun home season. You know, we really appreciate the incredible crowd support we've had this year. Um, it's been just good energy in the VC. What a cool place to play. Yep. What a great um, team to, to come and watch. I've been so proud of this team and how hard they compete for the fans and for the community. And, and what a great university to represent. It's been fun, but there's plenty more volleyball to yeah. come. And I know the fans will be watching closely next yeah. weekend. Yes. As will we. Look forward to it. Thank you. And go Cougars. That's the Cougars head coach, Leah Johnson, with us here. Post game as the Cougars defeat UT Martin to improve to 19-6 and six overall here this season.